Okay. Just, let me just brainstorm. Sure, sure. Okay, so the first one is the overall arching. The second one was the ship sinking. The, the fan. Two photographs. The third one. Shit, what was that called? My name is Thea Augustina Eck, and I am an installation artist, and I live in Ann Arbor, Michigan, and that's where I have my studio as well. Providence is inspired by Ernest Shackleton's autobiography, South, which um, is based on the Endurance Expedition to Antarctica in 1914 through 1917. Uh, the work is comprised of about around a little over 300 nautical flags um, crisscrossing their way through the space, um, through the stairwell, and there's also four bells that hang down towards towards the bottom and each of those bells is playing a different piano composition that I wrote and and played. The work ends up stemming from the narr or the materials end up stemming from the narrative. Shackleton is making with two other men the 36 hour trek across South Georgia Island from one side of the island where they had landed on using a lifeboat to the other side where they're trying to reach a whaling station. Those phrases I've I've extracted are his reflections about reaching civilization, um, hope being hopeful towards finally going home or finding other you know, um, finding other men on the other side of the island they're more reflecting on more of that like his existential journey opposed to kind of that physical journey that they were taking if i was to give advice from what i've learned uh, it would definitely be that idea of curiosity and f following through and just always being curious, curious about material, curious about what you're reading, curious about what you're seeing. It's like that idea of wa walking down the street with your head up opposed to where your feet are going. <laughs> um, just looking at the world, there's, there's so much out there and there's so much to react to, but then letting yourself to be able to reflect on what you're seeing too. And I think that is hard when you're trying to work a job and still make art is giving yourself that reflective time to to make sense of what you're making um, but it's really important um, and because your curiosity will get lost within only being curiosity and not turning into anything and yeah